Grady Go to my heart so you cannot take it To my mama, I know I'ma make it Nigga run up, we still in the Satan Stay the same, no, I ain't not changing For the fame, I'm chasing the greatest Lately, I'm losing my trust, not loving no hoes What's up, Sneaker and family? Everybody again for another banger video for you guys. Just today's a new day, so of course it's gonna make it great. Yes, today, guys, I got y'all another banger because I will be doing a continuation, a part two to a video that I did a couple months ago. Yes, that was the top five underground streetwear brands you guys should know about in 2022. But instead, it's part two. And yes, you guys really like part one, so I'm gonna go ahead and give y'all part two and put y'all into a more five brands, you know, five more brands. And yes, again, I will say this, is that these underground clothing brands, their manufacturers are probably small as well as the small clothing brand, you know? And then basically what happens is that, you know, a couple brands you might run into might have already stuff pre-made, but most brands, what I've seen they've been doing is that they drop all the clothes and then basically everybody orders it. And once the site closes, the owner, he sends like the big order of all the stuff that needs to be made. He sends that to the manufacturers and the manufacturers make all them clothes, you know, make all the orders, then fulfill the order and send it back to the owner. Then the owner ships out all the stuff to you guys that purchase. But yes, all this is said to say that it might take a minute for your order to come in on the, you know, on the website. They'll probably have a banner that says at the top how many weeks or, you know, how long it'll take for your stuff to get shipped. And yes, also, if you guys really want to keep up with y'all stuff, I would definitely suggest using this app called Shop. And yes, boom, right here. Definitely go tune in with this app. It really helped me out a lot when I ordered from these underground clothing brands. And yes, that's it, really. That's all I want to talk about, really. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and cut the chit chat. Let's go ahead and get to these five underground streetwear brands and yes don't forget to subscribe like comment all that good stuff on the road to five thousand subscribers as i'm gonna stop talking now and yeah all right guys so for the first clothing brand i do want to talk about we do have this brand called you love sk and yeah boom right there that's the instagram and that's the name of the brand and yeah so with this brand they have a decent selection of, of you know clothes to offer i'm looking at the site right here and yes basically mostly what they have is zip ups so like cool prints on them they have like different varieties of colors then they have a uh, hoodies and yes they're cropped as well and if you don't know what a cropped hoodie is imagine the hoodie but they cut the waistband off of the bottom of the hoodie that's a cropped hoodie but yes also they do have like jeans as well but they're made out of like leather material they're waxed and they also do have a like a cool little ski mask that you guys can buy as well because i know a lot of you guys love them push ice ski masks but these that he has on the website is definitely more unique and yes i've seen the you know the owner of the brand on tiktok you know i've seen him talk about his brand and stuff like that he has a really good selection of clothes that i would definitely suggest for you guys to go on but yeah, i'm gonna cut the chit chat i'm just gonna go ahead and put up all the products that's on the site up on the screen for y'all so yeah here y'all go boom And yes, with this brand, their sizes do run from an extra small all the way up to a 2XL. So as long as y'all can fit in them sizes, y'all good. And I will say that their clothes are kind of pricey, but it depends on what you want. But if you want to, you know, spend some money to get fly, I would definitely suggest going to this brand. You love SK. Yes, again, Instagram, boom, right there. She'll be right there. But yeah, that's the first brand, You Love SK. Let me know what you guys think of this brand in the comments down below. Personally, I really do like this brand. When I get, you know, when I really want to shop for some clothes again and get some nice stuff and get fly, I'm definitely going to this brand. Yeah, without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and move on to the second brand now. And yeah, all right, guys. So the second clothing brand I do want to talk to you guys about is a brand called Billionaire Studios. And yes, boom right there. That's the IG and that's the name of the clothing brand. Yes, with this brand, I will say and I will admit, this is probably the priciest brand. You know, the most expensive brand I'm probably gonna put on this series because like, for I'm looking at this stuff right here on the site. Like for like, they have like nice shirts and stuff like that, but it's like 120 for a shirt. 200 for a zip up but i saw a couple videos on their stuff and they they're, they're made out of good quality so their sizes do range from a smaller to an extra large actually so if you guys want to cop you guys can but yes i'm just looking at the site and yeah some stuff they might have a 2xl 3xl in it looks like their hoodies they have a bigger size in and, you know the shirts are smaller than they got uh pants as well a lot of like uh what is this, like cargo denim so yes they the waist size is from a 30 all the way up to a 36 so you guys that's it really with this brand. I'm just gonna go ahead and cut the chit chat and put like, you know, my favorite pieces up on the screen for y'all. So yeah, here y'all go. Oh yeah, and I forgot to mention, they have like cool little face masks as well. Hopefully I put those up on the screen. Honestly, that's probably the one thing I caught from the brand. But yes, that's the second brand, Billionaire Studios. Go tap in with them. Yes, I know this is probably the most expensive brand I've put on a series already but if you guys really want to spend some bread on some good pieces and you really do like the stuff billionaire studios where it's at i'll probably cop a piece once 
But yes, that's this brand, Billionaire Studios. We're gonna go ahead and move on to the third brand now. And yeah, right, guys, so for the third underground clothing brand I do wanna talk about, we do have this brand called Pray for Tune. And yeah, boom right there, that's the Instagram right here. Yeah, so this brand, they're really mostly known for their zip ups. Yes, they have like puffer prints on the zip ups. They look really, really nice. Yes, the sizes range from a smaller to an extra large, if I'm not mistaken. And yes, the price of the zip ups is not even that bad. You know, it's like $68, $70. That isn't bad for a zip up with puff, you know, puffer print. Because, you know, puffer print. You know, it's usually not expensive. Well, I'm about to say not expensive. It's not cheap. You know, puffer print. If you want to get that good puffer print, it's going to cost you a pretty penny. But yes, I'm going to go ahead and put up all the stuff for y'all on the screen for y'all. So here y'all go. Boom. Yeah, let me know what you guys think of this clothing brand in the comments down below. I put up the zip ups that they got up on the website right now and a couple of the previous drops because they got a small selection of stuff at the moment. But their zip ups are really, really nice. So if you guys really want some more like zip ups in y'all, you know, wardrobe, I would definitely say go check out Pray for Tune. Again, Pray for Tune. Yes, every time I do one of these videos, just to let you guys know, it's no promo. I'm just showing love, you know, putting y'all on to some good brands that I personally would shop from. But yes. That's this brand. We're gonna go ahead and move on to the fourth underground clothing brand now. And yeah, all right, guys. So for the fourth underground clothing brand, I do want to talk to you guys about. We do have this brand called Headless Forever. And yes, boom right there. That's the name of their Instagram and that's their brand name. Yes, with this brand, I've been following them for like a hot minute. I want to say like a year and a half now. Yes, I've seen this brand progress and progress, and I still haven't copped yet, which I am kind of upset about. But this brand really does offer some nice stuff. Like they have zip ups, shorts. They even dropped track suits in the past. Yes, they dropped a whole bunch of stuff. Yes, the recent drop was shorts, and they had like a big collection, and there's so many different colorways, but they wear like the uh, basketball shorts with like the holes in them. If you guys know what I'm talking about, you know. But yes, there's zip ups as well. Like when they dropped them, I didn't realize that they had tech wear inside of them. Like it looks so fire. But yes, I'm just gonna cut all the chit chat and you know, just go ahead and put up all like their previous drops up on the screen since the site is closed right now. I'm just gonna go ahead and show you guys what they had dropped in the past. So yeah, here you guys go. Yes, what I've seen, their sizes usually range up from like an extra small all the way up to a 2XL. So if you know sizes, you good. But yes, that's this brand, Headless Forever, again. And yeah, we're going to go ahead and move on to the last and final brand now. And yeah, let's go. All right, guys, so for the last and final clothing brand I do want to talk to you guys about, we do have this brand called Num Studios. And yes, boom right here. That's the name of their IG. And that's also the name of the clothing brand as well. Yes, with this brand, I feel like it's probably one of the smallest and underrated brands I've ever put on a series so far. Yes, with this brand, they've dropped a couple, you know, shirts in the past. Like right now on their site, they have like t-shirts, you know, sad boy t-shirts. I'm gonna put it up on the screen. So yeah, boom right there. Let me scoot you over a little bit. Yeah, boom right there. Yes, these tees are like $25. And honestly, that's a decent price because we just talked about a brand that was selling tees for $120 compared to $25. I would definitely say go ahead and you know tune in with this brand like for they have a lot of stuff to offer in the past also dropped some shorts you know some hoodies with like really nice prints on them and then also some tees as well some more tees and yes right now the brand i just looked on their um instagram they have some juneteenth shirts dropping yes they're gonna be available on juneteenth at 3 p.m eastern so yes boom right there that's the post yes honestly this tee is very hard i really do like it Yes, I'm just gonna go ahead and put up all the rest of the stuff that I didn't show on the screen for you. So yeah, here y'all go. Boom. Yes, we will wrap it up for those top five clothing brands I think you guys should know about in 2022 part two. Yes, let me know what you guys think of these brands in the comments down below. And also comment, what brand do you guys think you'll be most likely to cop from? But yes, I'm gonna go ahead and end it off here. Again, tune in to these brands. Like for, I feel like a lot of these deserve a lot of recognition. And yes, if you guys want this to continue to be a series, just go ahead and keep liking the video and keep supporting because y'all went up really on part one. Like I really appreciate you guys for that. And yes. I will see you guys later. And yes, here is the biggest, littest family on YouTube now. And yeah, peace.